Good morning folks, 21st Century Caveman here. Hope everybody's safe, hope everybody's well. So today I'm going to be doing a video about a tool, a power tool, which I think is desirable but not essential. And I've previously made videos about tools such as, you know, the top five power tools for DIY and home improvement, etc. And I've also talked about some of the um, other types of tools, the cheaper, more budget type power tools from places like Lidl and Aldi, and whether or not they're cheap or indeed represent excellent value for money. So I thought this video would complement those. Now in the aforementioned videos I've listed what I believe to be the top power tools for the DIYer or handyman, certainly the ones which I consider to be the most useful. However it is clear that this is a very personal opinion and will of course depend on the nature of the job you choose to do, your skill set and those types of jobs which you feel comfortable doing. And I think it's also fair to say that there are a multitude of other power tools out there which are also extremely useful which haven't made my list. And there is one in particular which I'm going to make the video about now. One power tool which I think is desirable to have but not essential. So basically in other words what I'm saying is this will be a power tool which will be very useful to have and would certainly come in useful on those occasions when you actually need a power tool um, of this description. So these are going to be situations whereby you're not going to be performing these task, uh, tasks as frequently and it may well be the case that the other tools which you have may not simply be up to the job and alternatively it may well be the case that they provide a valuable and very cost effective alternative to say hiring out a piece of equipment which ultimately you're going to have to pay for then you're going to have to give it back whereas if you're to buy this particular power tool and it being a reasonable quality item at a fair price once you've actually done your task clearly you don't have to give it back it's yours for good and you're free to use it over and over again and the power tool I'm referring to is a Titan SDS plus power drill now I've had this drill for about two and a half years now and I've, I've used it about half a dozen times which isn't a lot really given the length of time I've actually had it so basically and it hasn't had a tremendous amount of use however what I can say is that on the occasions I have used it it's been an absolute godsend and has made jobs which would otherwise be completely miserable and very hard work very easy indeed now clearly there's no point in paying top dollar for a tool you'll only be using occasionally but it's equally obvious that you don't want to be a skin flint and just buy a cheap piece of which might just about cope with the job in hand and then the next time you go to fire the thing up it doesn't work or it's broken now this SDS plus Titan drill I've actually used it to break up bits of concrete I've used it to remove blobs of mortar on the underside of used paving which I'm going to be reusing um, help to clean them up and also of course they can be very heavy and it makes them more manageable to move around I've also used it to make, break up the concrete foundation of fence posts when I'm actually replacing some fencing rather than having to attack these concrete boulders with a hammer and a chisel and believe you and me I've done that on more than one occasion and it's also fair to say that on reflection I should have bought this SDS drill a good few years ago and it would certainly have enabled me to complete certain projects mainly fencing projects really if I'm honest in an easier and much quicker and efficient manner so look I think this is a perfect example of one of those power tools which would be very desirable to have but not absolutely essential because it's not a power tool which you'll need every other day or every other week so you use it every now and again but the tasks for which you do use it are really going to be not particularly pleasant they're going to involve a lot of hard graft sweat and toil if you don't have it so look guys that's my opinion let me know what you think and whether or not you have any alternative suggestions thank you for tuning in bye bye